If you have a lot of courses on your Canvas dashboard, it might be hard to find the one that you're looking for. One thing that you can do is get rid of some of these courses. You can basically follow the steps in my adding courses to dashboard video to see how that's done. Another thing you can do is add an image. So you see this sand on my sandbox, a panda for learning Canvas, strategy for my game theory class, and some bell curves for statistics. In order to add an image, you can go into a course and click on settings and upload an image. Other things you can do is change the name because the name that you get assigned to you maybe isn't the best one for you to use. So here I've changed the name a little bit and whatever is in this name field is going to appear in the courses list. When you go to courses, you see that is the name that we have. On your dashboard, it will also be this top blue line for a course. However, you can nickname a course and change what that top blue line says. Maybe this is your 10 a.m. class and you could call it that. Hit apply. Now it says 10 a.m. class and that way you know what you're looking at. The nickname is also viewable under all courses. Now this nickname will not appear for everyone. Only you. You could change to a different nickname and you can also change the color of the background square here. Click apply. So when you change the color of the background square, you may not want them all to be the same color because this is the color that will pop up on the calendar for events in this class. When you go back to a course's settings, you see course code, which is initialized to be the same as name. And you may wonder how they differ. Well, for one thing, the course code is what you see up here in the navigation breadcrumbs. If you go to your dashboard, it is also this gray line. I hope this video can help you find your courses quickly and accurately.